Hey there, I had a question asked today about how to customize this Airbnb inventory checklist. And um, so basically this is on how to um, add more columns and I will show you how to do that here. So the question is, is I just ordered your inventory sheets and I wanted to add additional bedrooms and bathrooms. Okay, so we've got everything here on the first and second columns and then we've got notes. So basically what you want to do is you want to count out how many rows you have here. So this is, um, let's see. So this is 21 rows. And what I did was, I'll click here. Okay. Clicking on the number 27 and not really dragging, but you're, there we go. You're kind of clicking the 27 and kind of dragging to the right. And then you're grabbing all of these. Okay. So then you're going to right click and it says insert 22 rows. Let's do it below. So now it inserts all of that down here. And then you want to click down here, grab everything, hit the control C for copy. And then you're going to paste control V and then it's going to add in a whole nother group for you. And so that way you can add, so you've got, you know, all these bedrooms and bathrooms here. So you can just add in new columns. So you would just type in, you know, bathroom three or bathroom four and, and so on. And then you can just delete out any of these here and then type in whatever you like. Does that make sense? Okay. Let's see what the other question is. Okay, the next question was they wanted to add in a quantity column next to wine glasses. So this would be easy. So you're going to go here. Hold on, let me put. Okay, so we're in column D and that ends um, your section here. So it's kitchen and dining. So we're going to click on D, right click and insert column to the right. And then you can put in QTY for quantity. And then if you wanted all of that underlined, you just have to highlight and you would go to the little borders button and then you want it horizontal borders. Oh, let's do border color. And I think it was a lighter one. Let's see. Horizontal borders. Nope. It was still a little bit lighter than that. Hold on. Let's figure out what color it was. There we go. Um, so then that way you can add the quantity. So one, two, three, and so on. And then you hit E and then you could go in here and then do a center. So that way everything is centered. So that's how to do the cool add quantity if you wanted to do that. So if y'all have any more questions, feel free to reach out. My shop is savvyandthriving.com and I uh, hope y'all have a good day.